Yo, yo. Yo. Yeah. Alright, I'm back. I want in or not. Oh, you did? Nice. Yeah. Nice. Y'all been doing y'all thing. Yeah. I don't know who that guy was. Yeah. Did you say anything? No. Weird. <laughs> Weird. 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 Weird motherfuckers. We're going in the party. Don't shit. Was there yesterday, too. Oh, he was? Thought that was one of y'all's homes. Nah. I don't know who he is. What was his name? Low something. Yeah, low. Low something. Yeah. Still on fight night. Thank you. I just got on. I started my life. Oh. Just started. Right, do some care about daylight later or something. Yeah. Good that. evening, everybody. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and welcome to the Metro Manila Arena. We're here in the Philippines for a much anticipated main event. Ten rounds in the heavyweight division. We are looking yeah. forward to this fight, especially yeah. after seeing what happened Damn, in the way in yesterday. A stare down that nearly resulted in a count breaking out right there. Everybody's been waiting for these two to meet up. Now they do. Okay, and Roger round that. One is underway. <laughs> <laughs> He's committed to the combination punching now. He's working out well up top. He's showing what a skilled fighter he is with the counter punch. Well, the old times used to say when you come in there, when you control there, you can make him do what you want. He made him tie his shoelaces right there. Body shot! Body shot! You know, a lot of folks say that he's an unorthodox fighter. We know he's a true game, athletic. Yeah. But at What's some point, that ability to tie things, that ability to be flashy and showy and utilize speed, it can have so many fundamental flaws, can it? I mean, well, no, more. it does have fundamental flaws. I mean, that's what it is. I mean, you're depending on the awkwardness of it, the unorthodox approach of it. You know, you're depending on oh, evil wish. pure skill, oh, yeah, evil you know, wish. whether it's the skill of sense of timing and anticipation, oh, this year? reflexes, yep. you're dependent on that. And when that doesn't work, yeah, you can make a mistake when the guy times you right. Well, there's nothing there technically to cover yourself. The glove's not there, the, the good habits aren't there. And you pay a price, a steep price. That is it right there. I mean, that's what impresses the judges. The three-punch combination by Golden. He missed by a mile. That wasn't even close by Raging Bull. Unbelievable pace here tonight. Both guys have no plans of having this fight so far. I'm sure the frame of reference for most is Hagler Hearns. Yeah, you right, here we go. If it's going to live up to that so far, so good. A good round. This was definitely a good round. Oh, no. Just 10 seconds to go in this round. And this round comes to an end. A round that was highly entertaining. They put forth a non-stop effort. Well, that's the styles that they figured to bring to this fight. Both guys with good motors. It's too close. You hear me? It's too close. We don't want this to go to the judges' scorecards, all right? <coughs> His ass tired. His ass super tired. Here we go. He got about, Round about 20 two pounds. Got this kid in his pants. <laughs> <about now. laughs> nice. Lance flush with the two punch combo by Raging Bull. That's a solid right hand by Ferguson. Oh, hands up, hands up. Missed the body shot. A nice lead jab by Raging Bull. Zoning in with the 
overhand left. Solid right by Golden. Raging Bull is so dangerous with that accuracy. A two-punch combination landing. Headshot lands was a hook. Punch combination there is going to impress the judges. Nice block by Ferguson. Raging Bulls hit by a counter punch there. Good exchange. He fires back. Boy, that worked out well with the uppercut. Very nice work there. Jab, uppercut. Hey. Non-stop energy from both guys in this round. The final minute is here. Good defense just covering up down low. A little something for his opponent after getting tagged. Oh. Wow, that's Raging Bulls putting forth for that hard work he did in God training damn. camp there, landing a crisp combination. Up top with a quick hook. Play. Targeting a left hand down low. Final 10 seconds of round number two. Good round. Golden's going to really regret when he hears the scorecards read because he lost that last round just based on defensive laziness. Well, you can always make comparisons, analogies. You watch a basketball game, you say, you know what, this team, Joe, is losing because they're not rebounding, they're not boxing out underneath the boards. Well, guess what? They weren't taught how to do that. You have to know how to do that. He's not going to start showing you defense if he doesn't know how. He does not know how. He has not been taught. Right down there. Oh, yeah. Uh, that's why you need to put yeah, that twitch on. That's why you need to put that twitch on, you know? The, yeah. the, the save your the video. Yeah. And round number three is underway. Golden's showing you a little defensive oh, skill there. Right? They'll move away from that punch. Hey, keep your feet moving. Oh, he right. His opponent wanted the body. He wouldn't give it to him. I like the way he went up top that time with the hook. Good clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Ferguson. Good step back counter punch there. So right from the start in this fight, he's committed to the body shot. Well, that's the time to go there, right at the beginning, because body work pays off for you later in the fight. No sense in wasting time. Get right to it. Oh, he is stunned. He could go down. Big, big shot comes crashing home. One long hook to the body, and he is down and in bad shape. Three, four. He went down from a big shot. Now he's got to have some big guts to move along. You're going to find out exactly what he's made of. Downstairs with a right hand. Well targeted two punch combo by Raging Bull. Up top with the right hand. Okay. Nice work, nice work. That's okay. Raging Bull's yeah. gonna think about the next time he throws a punch because he just yeah. got hit by a good solid counter. A little something of his own. Blocks the shot and brings back the uppercut. And that does it for this round. No worry, all right? I just need you to focus. Keep your hands up, keep working the jab. It's all yours, baby. But you gotta keep working. Keep working, and this is your fight. No. Don't get lazy, on me, okay? Don't get lazy. Don't get You're winning lazy. this fight. But don't get lazy. Don't get lazy. Don't get lazy. Mm -hmm.
start of round number four. A chance to look at Teddy's scorecard. Raging Bull's been unable to pull away from his opponent so far. It's an even fight. Yeah, it is, and I think you just said it right. Unable to pull away. Whoever's going to pull away, if that's going to happen in this fight, it's going to come from the outside. Whoever starts to commit to that jab. Ferguson banged around by a big uppercut. Well, I don't know if he's hip to the idea of becoming a counter-puncher, but I get the sense you'd agree with it. Yeah, definitely. I mean, he's got the perfect platform, the perfect ball for it. The guy's walking in right now, not moving his head much. He can time him, he can counter him. Blocks a shot, and then does nicely to work on his own. Oh, a good right hand by Golden. Welcome to you, then Nicole. Halfway through round number right. four. That's great yeah, stuff. He fires one right back after Where taking gotta one. Gotta love the work by Golden. Good combination to the body. And a nice football. Ball. That will be winning. I hope you win. Golden, Golden once again, the target of the hook. God damn. Is there a very be yeah, he, uh, to the body, he, he does forgot that. about his game. His well, you can see what he the, wanted the to do there, but unable to land that body shot. There's that proficient jab by Raging Bull. Targeting that belt line with the right hand. With the Raging Bulls missing the mark Damn, by a mile. That just was nowhere to be found. <laughs> that big one. <laughs> what, the hell? what the hell is this mark? End of the round of what has been a very close and highly competitive fight. Teddy, how do you see this right now? I see it almost dead even. And I see whoever finishes the rounds, because they're both kind of tight rounds. If you finish up good, the judges remember that. You want this fight? Because listen to me, man. If you want this fight... Tough fight to score. Very, very even. Closely contested bout throughout. Ferguson's coming up with the answers, avoiding that punch. Nice block by Ferguson. Ferguson's coming through now beautifully. That's the combination punching he wants to put forth. Golden's doing a good oh, job of putting good. his punches together. His opponent's got to be wondering, how do I stop this? Well, right oh. now, you, you made a good point there because right now his opponent is wondering too much. You know, he's just busy blocking the punches, wondering about the combination. He's not getting off. Oh, that was nice. Raging Bull swinging and missing like he's at bat right there. That punch was nowhere near his opponent. Look at that combination by Ferguson. Move your head. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by Golden. Hey. Hey man. I'll run it. Doing well here with that two punch combination. Well targeted counter punch by Ferguson. He gives as well as he takes. You saw it on that exchange. Body. Seconds. Yeah, Raging Bull's the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. 
find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. And round five comes to an end. Golden's looking really good after that round, Teddy. I think it's a good fight. I think it's a close fight, but I believe it's a fight that he's winning. Yeah, it's the kind of fight, though, that you can't afford to let up at all. Or do what you just said. Think that you're winning. He can't really think that way. He's got to think that he's got to take one round at a time. The rest of the rounds, he's got to win each one of them. Not one stand here and watch you take those shots. Do you understand me? And we are underway for what is the second half of this fight. Who knows what we're in store for? able to land the headshot. Ferguson's doing well, sticking to a game plan on the outside. Raging Bull showing you that sublime skill right now with that two-punch combo. So swiftly able to turn defense into offense. Nice counter punch. And what you're noticing here is his opponent is starting to be a little wary of letting his jab. Did you yeah. see that? Thank and he you. goes down. It was so a magnificent so combination that put him down. Now he has to get up. Beautiful combo. So now the question becomes, after that knockdown, and he has gotten up, how does he survive? So one of the ways he survives is if he's been taught, have good habits, have good fundamentals been put there. You're going to find out right now, he needs them right now. Raging Bull's not having things go his way tonight, but there's one easy explanation for it. He's barely moving. He's just stationary there. And his opponent's taking great advantage of that. He's coming in, he's finding them, he's giving them angles. You know, I think part of it is frustration. He's not moving because he's being kept off balance. And right now, he's just not thinking right. Oh, a big shot comes home for him. Oh, that's beautiful stuff, Teddy. That is beautiful work with that combination for the knockdown. Well, that's the benefit of putting them together. One sets up the other one. Six. Seven. Good fight. Come on. Nine. Get to your feet. Ten. It's over. Fight is over. Golden's in prime form. Power surge here. Knockout winner. As we saw, he was up on your scorecard throughout the evening. Shoulder back, see a ghost a little bit. Disappear on him, come back with the right hand. Good work with the uppercut. Nice job there. That's a flush shot, banking away those body shots with the left hand. Good combination by Ferguson. 
To improve that accuracy, miss with the headshot. Really good work right there, landing the two punches in sequence by Reyes. Golden's knowledge of the game is showing through. Three ways to defend, one of them is the block. He did it there well. A solid true uppercut by Ferguson. Good round. Ten seconds to go in this round. Where AD at? Round comes to an end. And that's one of those rounds, Teddy, that just takes on a certain style, a certain characteristic. And that was a busy one. Yeah, it was a busy one. Look, Joe, you don't have to look for these guys. They're right there in front of you. Why do you think that is? Why do you think sometimes you just get those rounds where it all happens? Because of styles, you know, styles make fights. In this case, you're seeing proof of that right there. Both guys that are aggressive, both guys that are very confident. Zoning in on that gut. Combination punch downstairs. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire right back with one of his own. Good work by Ferguson. Nice. Reyes is at his best when the combinations are landing. He scored well there with that combo. Takes a step back, then the counterpunch by Reyes. Very similar to what you see Floyd Mayweather do. You know, make a miss, pull that shoulder back, and then come right back with the counter. Reyes is giving us something to think about early on in this fight here, but his opponent has even more to think about. He has established the jab already. Yes, he has established the jab, and now his opponent has to think about moving his head so he can get past it. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Ferguson. Ferguson's got a little something coming back at him. A counter punch scored. Let's see some more head moves. Let's see some more head moves. Get out of the way. Nice strike after catching one by Ferguson. Golden's combination punching working out well there. He landed three solid shots. Final 10 seconds. And that's the end of round two. Reyes's corner has to keep him calm. That's the kind of cut that can send a fighter into fits. Yeah, and a corner man into using crazy glue instead of adrenaline. I mean, that is a scary cut, as you just said. A knifing left hand by Golden. Ferguson's doing a really nice job of giving a wide array of punches here to his opponent. Yeah, he showed a good repertoire, and that's what you want to do. You want to be creative because then you set up other openings. Precision work with the left hand by Ferguson. Good clean shot returning fire. Well done by Golden. Sharp and accurate one-two by Reyes. Reyes is way off the mark. That punch didn't have a chance. Right on the mark with the hook up top. Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Reyes is right hand working well that time. He scored well. Took a shot, now he gives a left. Reyes' nose is cut, and you can see that it's worsening as this round goes on. Golden's opponent landing an effective counter punch right there. Able to avoid one, and then a razor sharp counter punch by the Dragon. Well, something's got to stick. He sends the combination to the body. And now he brings the left hand upstairs. Great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Ferguson. 
Golden's opponent knows exactly what the game plan can be now. That counter punch landed with some success. <laughs> Our first chance to take a look at Teddy's scorecard here as round number four is underway. Ferguson's in control so far, two rounds to one. Still anybody's fight. I think he's been the busier guy, though. Yeah, he has been the busier guy. And also, he's been the better real estate agent. You know, location, location, location. He's been in the right position for his style. He's been in tight. Teddy, there are opportunities that are here for him, aren't there? Yeah, counterpunch opportunities because he's got an opponent who's walking in a little bit. Now he has a chance to start to chuck something back at him a little. Very accurate two-punch combo by Golden. He missed with that headshot. Where's the body? The Dragon's impressing the judges and himself with that right hand. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Now he's backing Ooh. his man up against the ropes. Trying to go downstairs, but off target. He got hit right there, but he also... Come on, he should've got tired down there. Oh, it's all good. I've been knocked down before. I ain't worried about it. <clears throat> Good jab by Golden. Golden's combination punching here is like showing that. you what good boxing me. is all about. Three punches thrown, three punches landed. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. A well-timed right hand by Ferguson. Reyes' lack of defense right now is showing up. His opponent scoring with the right hand consistently. Yes, he's found the target for that early on, and he's just staying with it. Nothing fancy. And round four comes in. Oh, yeah. The Dragon's probably trying to assess things right now as that round comes to an end. I think it's a close, good, solid fight that he's still very much in, but I do think he's on the downside of the scorecard. Yeah, but the most important thing is he has to know that. See, that's the thing. Can a fighter be honest with himself? And that's where the corner comes in. Somebody has to whisper in his ear and say, hey, listen, you might think you're in this place, but the reality, you're not. He scored well after being hit himself. Well timed by Golden. He took a step back, landed the counter punch. Exactly what he wanted to do. There's that southpaw jab in the left hand. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Halfway into round number five here. He missed that uppercut. there by Ferguson. Scores well to the head with the right hand. Reyes has got to do more than this. I mean, you can't just sit there stationary and expect the night to go your way. This fight is going opposite of how he needs it to go right now. Well, maybe it's not, Joe. Maybe he's given up already. You know, it's all about what's going on in the mind of a fighter. Maybe he's given in, and this is his way, believe it or not, of getting the ref to stop this fight. The Dragon's combination punching is working well here. Accurate shot, straight right hand comes in. Digging in with a left Come on, the gun. Man, Hello? And that has some fight to it, that right hand by Reyes. Oh, and now another 
Fuck you. Takes one, but gets one. Good work by Golden. You got a good By both men to fire off those right hands. Golden's being so very effective, punching in combination. And that's what you want. He's got pretty good hand speed. Might as well use that hand speed. No better way to use it than put oh. them together. <clears throat> Wash right hand to the hand. Yeah, still fighting. I'm in the sixth round going to the seventh. Yeah, I'm All in right. the fourth. I'm still. Working our way towards the bell, last 10 seconds of the sixth. And round six comes to an end. Reyes' is cut man is going to earn his pay for sure. That is a bad gash. And I wondered what he's using in there. You know, you can only use certain things, Avertine, Adrenaline, and Thrombus. I wondered if he's using legal things right now because that's the kind of cut and capture to use crazy glue. Well done, three punch series of punches there by Ferguson. Turn that hook I over but couldn't turn it into a connect. say punchers are born teddy but what about a guy's ability to withstand big punches what about a guy's chin you know that's an interesting point part of it is physical and you know what it is it's the neck that's the shock of Jordan, but most of it's mental you have to want to take the punches you have to will yourself through the punches this guy has no, so will. No. fine work with the double jab downstairs and he goes with a left hand. Good flush shot by Ferguson. The Dragon's got something to think about now. He just threw a punch and had one coming right back at him. His opponent scored well with the counter. He caught me now, right? Ten seconds Son to go in the seventh. A stabbing right hand comes in by Ferguson. And that's the end of round seven. I want I another round. This is your fight. I don't know. You're in the I'm not going to knock down twice. This is it. You know, not you me it. Time. Teddy Scorecard has this one sided fight. Really. Golden putting together a good looking fight here. He just doesn't have that highlight reel knockdown that you'd expect. No, but I give credit. You know, he's not forcing the issue either. You know, he understands his identity, he understands what he is and what he's not. Getting rid of that punch from his opponent. Ooh. Well blocked by Ferguson. Trying to erode away that body with the combination punching. Reyes is thinking right now that he's doing a good job defensively, but it's really My not the case. Man, Every yeah, so yeah. often, you will see a punch split that guard. Yeah, he's just standing there. First of all, the gloves, he needs to extend them just a little bit away, so as you said, those punches, you know, are going to force their way through to the target, which they're doing right now. They're getting down to him. They're getting through to him. Straight right was lined up, but he missed. And they decide to trade there. Oh, that's good stuff. Fires right back with one of his own. Good work by Ferguson. You're doing great. Cover your heads, kids. Oh, what a big hook to the head by Golden. Targeting that.
that midsection now with the combo. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by the Dragon. Him down with a headshot. That's exactly what the corner wants. Well done by Golden. Trying to bait me in for that straight. Yeah, he's trying to bait me in. I got for that. Oh, that Last 10 seconds of the eighth <clears throat> round. Blocking six as round, punch. Just Very good smart. defense by Golden. And round eight comes to an end. Ferguson's well conditioned to the realities of this harsh business of boxing. But even mm, though on, we man. know what we've seen out of some ringside scorecards through the years, I'd be shocked if everybody doesn't have him ahead in this fight right now. Yeah, but never be shocked in this business because you never know with these blind judges sometimes. I hate to say it that bluntly, but time and time again, you just get shocked when you hear the score at the end of the night. <laughs> nice work to the midsection with the left. Protecting his head well with his guard. Scoring well with that hook by Gold. Big right hand. Right, there it is. Not it was bad. in his stock, and he pulled the trigger with that straight shot, scoring the knockdown. And he had a beautiful sight there. Three. Reyes is back up on his feet. Let's see what he has now. A headshot blocked. That's it, like that. Halfway through the ninth round. Ferguson's defense is paying off now. Good right hand. Ferguson's left, landing well. The Dragon's landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. Blocks away that headshot. Ferguson's movement's really helping him out, avoiding that punch. I'm in the ninth round going. The Dragon turned bad by a right hand. I'm in the seven. He was stunned. Now he's in control. Momentum so critical. And that's the thing about this boxing game. One second you're in control, the next second you're not. That last round really damaged him. Reyes' face does not look good at all. You can see his corner trying to tend him. Yeah, they tended to him a little too late. What about in the gym? What about in training camp where you got to teach a guy, move your head. Don't get caught so you won't look that way. Maybe they didn't hands. do their job. Ferguson's so dangerous with that accuracy. A two-punch combination landing. Overhand right after blocking that away. Golden's opponent is saying to himself, I can't believe this. Every time this guy throws, it seems like he lands. He's very judicious with his work. Yeah, and that's not by accident. You know, that's his temperament. He has that kind of temperament. If you went out with the guy, you talk to the guy, you know. Reyes is hit. Big shot there. Not that and nobody know he ain't talking He goes down. Reyes is back up on his feet. Now, what will be interesting to see here is how he reacts in the next few moments. Little volume punching to the body there. Good fight. 
license taken away if you don't see this one the obvious way Teddy if one of these judges dare go another direction with this I want their picture up on a post office board most wanted poster yes sir so right now what we want is to hear I'm Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to the Metro Manila Arena here in the Philippines for a much anticipated main event. Ten rounds of heavyweight action, and now the time has come. All the talk, now comes the war. Okay, uh, not an easy fight. Get to know you here in the opening round scheduled for 10. See, the defense pays off as he gets rid of that downstairs. Bad Intentions is put forth a little boom, 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 a three-punch combination score. Nice, sharp, fundamentally sound hook right there, and it served him well. Starting to score at ease against his opponent there. Anytime you can land a three punch combination, you're really hitting your groove. Keep it going. Oh, he just misses with that headshot. That is exactly mm. what the corner wanted to see a good combination punch by bad intentions. Basics here, as you can see, the jab becoming a key instrument for him. Boxing 101. You have an opponent walking in. You want to stay on the outside? Use that jab. So many times you hear of an early round where they're just feeling each other out. No way. Not these guys. Straight to action. Well, if they can keep this up, they're both going to have headaches, but we're going to have a special one on our hands. To the head he goes and lands well with the right hand left hook combo. Final 10 seconds of round number one. End of the round here, a round that saw a lot of action. The kind of round that fans pay to be here to see. Well, these are TV friendly fighters, and we figured that coming in. Cardi. Is in the ninth round or 10th? Uh, I think this is nine. Yo, what's up, Mario? Merry Christmas to you, homie. 
Here we go. Round two is yeah, that's understandable. Super two. Yeah, they get up artists, man. Bad intentions is putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Nothing there on the punch by Golden. Good block by Bad Intentions. Okay, man, be safe. That's as good as it gets right there. A crushing uppercut by Golden. That was a miss by Golden. He got hit, but he sends it right back. Oh, a nice two punch combo Ooh. by Golden. Bad intentions is playing maybe to have is a it Bay Packers winning? Because that cut of his. Oh, that's a game of Oh, it is. Who won? Well, there's three oh, sides that can be affected. He could be affected yeah. himself by seeing his own blood. His opponent oh, could get, oh, get affected. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. Come on, that early. Okay. Yeah, yeah. He could yeah. be affected a 20, little bit 20, by seeing that kind of blood. Ooh, a rocking dang. shot by Golden. Oh, Lord. Wow, stunned moments ago, but now somehow, some way, surviving Ooh, well. You know, Joe, I had a fighter that's once like that got dropped in a round, and he wasn't doing real good up to that point. After that, he fought better. He boxed better, he fought better defensively, and when the fight was over, I said, good job. You know, he whispered to me. He whispered, did I get knocked out? Yeah, he did. Huh. He didn't know what had happened. I realized then he was fighting on instinct the rest of the night. Amazing story. Now committing to that jab straight it. hand and it works it. out. Mm. Scored well with the left downstairs. And this mm. round comes to an end. Bad intentions is defense is going to need to shine when he gets deep. back out there. I mean, just look at the close-up of that cut we're seeing. Yeah, he's got to use his legs, right, very, Joe? He's got to get out there and buy some time Man, for those better to work. I don't know. I'm fighting somebody that's spectacular. <laughs> 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 they say you have to kill me, Hydro. But you're a fresh start. You know, Joe, we talk about having Putting a good down. shit all the time. Being able to shake off a good blow. But this is part of having a good shit. Being able to recover after being shaken out. After the round before. Good job with three flush punches by Ferguson. Ferguson's ability to properly throw and land his combinations has been stunning. Teddy, why is he so successful? Because you just said it. He's put them together. You know, one or two wouldn't land, but he's handcuffing the guy. And the he first two punches, they set wow. up the third and fourth. Nice. That's a right. forceful two-punch combo by Ferguson. What impact from that uppercut by Golden? Hey, man. We had a war. Did you win? Bad intentions. Oh, I won, but they didn't give me. You can see it's opening yeah. up now. Oh. Boy, that could be a factor later on. But good stuff, though. Good stuff. Yeah, good stuff. Resourceful one-two one combo by Bad Intentions. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Body shot in the left hand. Nice. That's a good one. Yeah. That was nice. He just threw yeah, the punch yeah. from his yeah. opponent yeah. and then a good yeah. counter by Golden. Yeah, like running through the rain without He's getting wet. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, boy. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. I like the way he was able to hook to the cut there. I went three and oh. That's it, man. You on fire. Three and oh. Teddy, that's the new, that's the that's the real deal, Teddy. Yeah. Let's take my time yeah. and focus. Last ten yeah, seconds that's of round number three. Focus, then that's when you start seeing the solo team. And yeah, but a and straight right by bad intentions. Your favorite. Keep your hands up. 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 Keep your hands
Interesting first three rounds we've seen so far. Kidding? Bad intentions is willing to engage in the fight. He's willing to throw punches, but he's losing every round. Yeah, I mean, you can throw punches, but it's kind of like spitting in the wind. You know, you can spit, but if the wind's blowing at you, it's going to come back and hit you in the face. And that's exactly what's happening here. He's throwing punches from the wrong direction, from the wrong distance, and they're coming back and hitting him right in the face. Able to block that away. It was targeted for his head. And there's the left hand working well for him again. Yes, he just missed that shot up top. That hurt right there. Teddy, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here tonight? Well, two aspirin and then go. Oh, no. Actually, I would say a little counter punching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription. <coughs> a crushing two punch combo by Golden. See him trying to cut down Let's that tree with a well placed oh, right thanks. hand. Thanks. in trying to bank away body shots with the combo. Give me that hit. That's what I want to hit. Get in there. Hard to believe they can still give like this in these final moments of what has been a sensational round. I feel like I'm back at the amusement park on a roller coaster again like a kid. Ferguson is doing very nicely on the outside here in this fight. What a smart combination by Bad Intentions. The tactical game paying off. You can see the counter punch. Yeah, you see the counter punch, but you know what I see? I see a little tentativeness now in him because he's afraid. Solid. That combination puts him down. One, two, three. Head combo. Create more counters, okay? Slip his punch, then throw straight right down the middle. Relax, relax. Take a deep breath. I need you to focus. Anticipate his punch. Every damn thing. God damn. That's the first one even on the beard. A new round underway here. Bad intentions is hoping that he doesn't make a defensive flaw like he did in the last round. That cost him a knockdown. See, that's where another set of eyes come in. That's where you depend on your corner. They're calm enough. Oh, they they can see something that you didn't see. As hopefully the corner has told him what he did wrong. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. Bad intentions is wanting the counter punch here, but that doesn't seem the route to go here in this fight, Teddy. No, he has to be honest with himself and see that. You, you know, told you, that. people under pressure in all walks of life, you know, in the ring, especially you see it right away. You, you kind of peek at it right away. It's obvious. Big, big shot he just scored with. He is floored by that combination. Absolutely floored. Four, five, and yeah. 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 So he is yeah, able to get up to his feet after that yeah. knockdown, but Teddy, yeah. it's what's ahead yeah. that's the problem. Yeah, we're getting a peek right now into his heart, into his soul. Halfway through this round here. Land the headshot. I'll be back. Okay. Uh -huh. Takes one to give one. He comes back with a right hand. Great work offensively landing that combination by bad intentions. Yeah, I'm gonna check you out when I'm done. Keep moving. Keep moving. He took a shot, but he came back with a right hand of his own. Bad intentions is failure to get away from his opponent's right hand 
is really the difference in this fight. It is. He continues to get hit with the same punch. He needs to slip to the left. Get caught up. You get caught up and you're fighting this fight. Focus for me. Keep doing what you're doing. Keep the jab pumping, then throw the lead right hand. You're winning this fight. Good, good. Nice work. Please. I want you to go downstairs and upstairs, okay? So the second half of this fight has now arrived. What an excellent two-punch combo by Ferguson. Bad intentions, his right hand scores well. He's showing what a skilled fighter he is with this counter punching. The graphics on this game is so damn. Nice strike after catching one by Ferguson. Good block there by Bad Intentions. Golden is a brawler, right, Teddy? Yeah, exactly. No. Is that the style that you think is going to carry him through? Because it's working out so far. Yeah, if he can keep Last it going this way, you know, he's going to be happy. He wants oh. to keep his opponent in this kind of mindset. Right now, he's got his opponent angry. I know that sounds funny, but he wants to keep angry because he's not thinking. He's fighting his fight. Bad Intentions is left now getting into the mix. Ferguson's hitting the mark right now. How precise was he there with that three-punch combo? Good clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Golden. Just still must Come on, keep the motion. That's one of the game. Creepy. There's the combo downstairs. <laughs> Good one, too, by bad intentions. Yeah, <laughs> and that's the end of round six. <laughs> now that he's back in the corner, we get a close-up look. Bad intentions is cut, even what's worse. And it's up to the fighter now, Joe, for his attitude not to change. You know, we can look at it, and we can say, wow, that cut looks worse. The fans can look at it and say that. But the now fighter I made me a must be steady. Video. The same attitude as though he doesn't have a cut. Otherwise, he has no chance of winning this fight. Ferguson's doing a nice job being comfortable on the outside. How about that? Another right hand. Shot. Bad intentions has gone into a defensive shell, but that shell has cracks in it. Yeah, it does. And the reason why he's getting cracks is because his opponent is confident that with those earmuffs on, you know, going into that pick defense that he is, he knows he's handcuffed. So he's putting together three, four, five punches where normally he would only throw one or two, worried something's going to come back. There's the combo to the body. And coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. Needs to improve that accuracy. Missed with the headshot. Oh, you see him with the left of the head there? Good job on the two-punch combo by Bad Intentions. Hey. Bad Intentions has got a bloody nose right now. Oh, I don't know God. if it's broken, but the bottom line is it's going to be a distraction. Uh, all right. Ferguson's on the bad end of a very impressive oh, push-up top. Lance Flush with the two-punch oh, combo by Golden. Committing well now to that left hand over the top. Good fucking game. Not what he was looking for. That's a miss right there by bad intentions. Almost cut my eyes. Ferguson's doing well here with that two punch combination. My boy. My boy, they need quad. Nice job to land that counter punch and getting away from one of his own by Golden.
your winner by knockout. Now, I think he so was in the decision not. win anyways. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> my baby, that's my baby. Yeah, that's yeah. right, that's right. Uh, 